Oh, sorry. Hi, and welcome to another Blender how-to video. In this one, we're gonna show you how to create a color map and texture. This is really important. You have to have created UV Unwrap, and I've made a video for this, so please go back for it. Um, so once you've created UV Unwrap, we're gonna create uh, a texture, and we're gonna be able to use it uh, that to color, uh, even do like some hand painting, um, 3D modeling stuff. So yeah, uh, let's get started. So you've created your uh, 3D unwrap, or, uh, UV unwrap, right? Uh, it's all good. Now select these both. I forgot to do this in the last video, but just gonna do pack islands and that's it. All right, now let's go back to the shade editor. And this is where we created our UV Unwrap, but you can go ahead and just delete it. It's still right here, don't worry about it. Now we're gonna go back, Shift A, Image, Texture. And we are gonna connect the base color right here. And if you've done this, and you get this dark coloration like that, that means you're in the right you're in the right place. All right, create new. Go to UV grid. I mean the generation type and select blank. Go to color and select white here. Press OK. And press the object. Edit mode. Press A. Your UV unwrap is still here. All right, great. And now you can go you can save and this will be uh, i'm just gonna put it in desktop for now uh and this is your um texture uh for your object or your model so save as image go back to your model press object mode and now we want to do some hand painting or just we just want to make it a certain color right uh go to texture paint select n tool and this will give you multiple options so one thing you can do is create a color palette which just means uh, select new and then whatever color we have selected if you hit a plus it'll save it for you and this will just save you time overall all right plus uh, you have radius so I'll make this bigger uh, strength just means if it's lower, it's a little softer, and if it's uh, one, it's well harder, but it's also oh you gotta change what's it called the stroke. So if you change the stroke, instead of light stroke, so it's a little better. Um, do the stroke to masking move. I know it's around here somewhere. I know my brush settings. Oh, fall off. Okay, so if your fall off is constant, you'll get something like lower this you'll get like a big button I'll take off stabilize stroke because otherwise it, it kind of just follows you like this but yeah um, so for your fall off if it's constant it'll just be like this if it's smooth or linear or I guess custom um, it's a little better to work with it just really depends on you but yeah, uh, and let's see if we're gonna do a fill color, it changes things up. So just take note of that. Fill everything up, press the draw button again, go back to that blue. As you can see, 
there are some parts that aren't fully filled out so you can go back and fill them in with the uh, draw tool right here and let's say you make a really nice model and you filled it out and like there's you can't see any little white spots you can come back over here to the texture um, and if you like see little dots and you want to fill them in but they're not showing over here it's fine to leave it alone if you want to fill them out go to image editor view paint and then paint and this is translated from what you select over here so if you select this color it shows up over here and this is how you can do some uh, uh, what do you call it some texture hand painting for your 3d model with the texture itself instead of on the 3d model either one works it really just depends on you but yeah um, there is cool right um, and let's see some symmetry so X right if I do to this one side it does to the other and that will help see because it does it to the back and then see all of it's useful so just take your time and learn about it but yeah this is how you use your UV unwrap to create a color map or texture that then you can draw on or change up uh, either on the model itself or the texture itself and create uh, a better looking model but yeah, um, hope this helps and until next video.